Hi my beautiful family and welcome back to my channel and welcome to this video. Today I'm very excited because we are going to try these from Revolution Eye Glisten. I have all five shades. I can't wait to try them on. My eyes can't wait to swatch them for you guys so you can see how they look. If you're interested then please keep on watching. Today I'm going to do two different makeup looks or I'm just going to try these on my eyes. I'm not going to do a wear test or anything. I just want to see how they are applying on the eyes. I already primed my eyes with Urban Decay Primer and also I did set it with some powder. I'm looking down because I'm trying to open the packaging. Uh, and I'm going to apply these over some crease eyeshadow that I haven't applied yet. I'm going to do that. Uh, with you guys so you see what I'm doing and I'm very interested to see how these are going to work because they look stunning they look so beautiful I was so excited when uh, Revolution came out with these I hope they will release more shades can't wait to see that I wanted to see, this reminds me of the Huda Beauty liquid I should have, I don't know how, what the name of those is that one side is matte and the other is glittery or shimmery I wanted to buy those, but when I went on the website, most of the shades were out of stock and then I got mad and never ordered anything. So I haven't tried this, but maybe I will do in future. These I ordered immediately and they had all the shades in the stock and I did wait to try them on because I have so many products to try. I have so many products to review. And if you know me guys, I don't like you reviewing too many products at the same time because then I won't know what's working and what's not working. But today I'm here just to swatch these, just to try these on my eyes, to, <laughs> everything is stuck on my hand, uh, to show you guys how they are playing. Let's start with this shade. This is Adore by You. So this is Adore by You. We have that metallic side. Very, very nice. Apply a little bit too much. Very nice. And then we have the glitter. I'm going to apply the glitter next to it. I think you should tap it like this. Yes. Oh, this one is beautiful. I want definitely try this on my eyes today. Dreamland. We have this metallic side. My swatches are terrible, but I hope you can see they are thick, but also drying very fast. That's good. These glitters are um, very nice, but I think you need to be lit up so you cover a lot. But this is so cute, so beautiful. Let's go in with the next shade. We have this red. This is in shade Desired. Stunning. Stunning, really metallic. I applied this one a little bit too, too thick, but that's me. Beautiful, beautiful. And then we have this one that looks so stunning, Your Truly. This has to be my favorite, I think, all, all of them. Because it's like a duochrome. It's yellow, but also pink, and I don't know. This one I want to try on my eyes too. I wish I had more eyes. So stunning. So stunning. Very, very nice. And then we have this. This one is... it. It's Fade. Oh, wow. I love this one too. I love this one too. Oh, which one I should try? I definitely need to do more makeup looks with these. Stunning. Stunning. Now when I look at this, this, I have to say that this first shade, this glitter from uh, Adored by You, it's very fine milled if you compare it with other shades. This one, uh, it's more fine milled than the others. 
but I like it. I like it a lot. I'm going, to go, I'm going to take this palette and go in with this shade here, just in my crease, just a little bit. So we have a, like a base crease. Okay, so let's go in with this first. I'm going to take this metallic and I'm going to do like a cut crease actually. And I'm nervous because they look liquidy, but let's go in and try it. Wow. I have so much glue on my eyes because I just filmed a review or tried five diff different um, eyelashes and I've been having a hard time to remove my um, glue, glue for my eyelashes. But I do everything for you guys. You can definitely do a cut crease with these. I can feel it wet on my eyes. I'm going to wait a couple of seconds before I look up because I don't want it to, to transfer on my eyelid. Okay. It dried and uh, I like it. It doesn't feel heavy at all. It kind of opened my eye a little bit more. I like it. This is how they look. Uh, you can definitely use only this side. You don't have to go in with the glitter, but I'm going to do that just to see how this is working. So I'm going to put this in the center. Oh, wow. I'm going to let it dry. Okay, I'm opening my eyes. This is looking beautiful. Really, really stunning. I really like it, love this shade. Okay, let's go in with this shade that is very interesting, very interesting. This is your Truly. This is so nice, do a chromy shade. Can't really see what I'm doing. Wow, this is such a beautiful shade. I don't know if you can see, but it looks... Okay, it's not perfect cut crease, so don't hate me for that. But this shade looks so beautiful. Doesn't feel heavy, but it kind of... I don't know if you can see, I have a hooded eyes. It's kind of... Because I took it a little bit above my lid, uh, it's kind of making it uh, more open. Can you see? Creating a new crease for me. So I like that because I have hooded eyes, so that's good. I like it. It opens my eyes. Let's go over with the, with the glitter to see how it looks. This is stunning. I really like how this looks. Uh, and maybe dark up the outer corner a little bit and that will make my look look beautiful. Let's see how you can put or build up the eyeshadow 
on the edge because sometimes I find that these shades are beautiful but when you try to go over with an eyeshadow to deep up the outer corner it doesn't really want to work so I'm trying to clean a brush let's go with this darker brown Yeah, I see it's kind of hard to go in with a darker shade. So be careful with that. Let's go with an even darker shade. Yeah, no, no, no. No. That was a mistake. Okay, so we now know that when you put it there, it's there and you're not going to be able to blend any eyeshadow after that on top because it just looks weird. But now we know. Uh, I don't have to try that when I'm in a hurry. Um, so that's good. We know now that that's not possible. But I definitely like it if we just put some mascara on because I feel like I look very weird. I mean, my eyelashes are so stiff together because I have so much glue on them, it looks weird. But we have something on the eyelashes. So I think, I think that I love this. I think this looks stunning on my eyes. And it feels like it's going to stay there. It doesn't feel heavy at all. And no fallout. I really, really like this. A win. Big win. I love this. They are not expensive. I don't know how much they are. Let me check it out. Okay, eight dollars. They are eight dollars. Available in five shades, and I have all of them, and I'm very happy because they are beautiful. I like liquid liquid eyelash eyelash. I like liquid eyeshadows. I don't use them a lot because I'm, I find them to be a little bit harder to work. But these, this was very easy. This was very easy. Though I will next time, of course, build up my eyeshadow, build up my outer corner, finish everything, and then go in with these. So I know I'm finished after they dry down because you can't go in, like I said, with another eyeshadow on top and try to blend it. It's not working. Don't try that. But these are beautiful. You don't have to use them together. You can use them by themselves. Um, but they are not going anywhere. Some glitter maybe, but everything else is stay. It's there. I love all of the shades. Maybe they will come out with a green and maybe more purple so we'll see but guys if you like this video don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you get notified every time i upload a new video thank you so much for watching and i hope i see you in my next video love you all bye